Okay class, today I'm going to ask you guys a few questions and we're going to take the answers to those and put them in what's called the tally chart. And a tally chart is a, is a way that we show numbers using symbols called tallies. And it's real simple once you get the hang of it. So what I want you guys to do right now is to think about what is your favorite activity of these ones up here to do? Is it paint, ride bikes, read books, play sports, or go on the play structure? Now, your favorite activity might not be one of these, but I want you to do for this um, right now is choose which of these is your favorite. If you had to choose one, because well right now you do, which one would be your favorite? Okay. So up here, who would rather paint? Okay. I see some hands up. Okay, I see four. Okay. So for every one of the children who raise their hands, for everyone who likes to paint, I'm gonna make um put a line in. It's kind of like a number one. There's one, there's two, there's three, and there's four. Okay. So the four children who chose that they like to paint more than the others, I put four lines in there. Now next is ride bikes. Who would rather ride bikes? Please raise your hand. I see three. Well, that makes it pretty easy to one line, two lines, and let's make that come down a little bit, and three. Okay. Because there's three kids who'd rather ride bikes. Only three of you guys want to ride bikes? Okay, okay. So next, what about reading books? Who would rather read books? I know a lot of you guys are trying to get your AR charm, so who would rather read books? Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, seven. Now this gets a little tricky. I'm not just going to put seven lines here. I'm going to have a little bit of a trick. Now I'll start out by one two, three, and four, but guess what? I'm not going to put just a fifth line right here. Okay, I don't want to do that. That's not how I show five, it's just five lines. I have to do a special line. On every fifth line to make a group of five, you put a line going across it. Okay. I like to think of it as like a strap that's holding them together or a rubber band. It shows that we have a group of five. So I have one, two, three, four, and this is five. Okay. But now I have seven kids who want to read books. So there's number six and there's number seven. Okay. Remember, when you see this line going across, you do have to count it. Okay. So this is seven. Okay. Now, how many kids would rather play sports of all these things? Okay. I have one, two, three, four, five, six. I have ten. Ten would rather play sports. So, just like before, I gotta start with my one, two, three. Four, and what do I do with my fifth one? Yes, my fifth line has to be a line that goes across. Okay. So it's five, six, seven, eight, nine. And since I have four lines right there, my fifth one is going to be a line that goes across. So when I count them up, I can count each line. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Or I know if I see these groups right here, these bundles with four lines, a line going across, that's just a group of five. So I can count by fives. 
five, ten. Okay. Now, how many kids would like to play on the play structure? Yeah, there's only three of you guys left. So, yep. One, two, three. Thank you for um, for each of you voting. I didn't. Nobody kept their hands down. And thank you for only voting one time each. Okay, that makes it a lot easier. So what we do with these tally charts, there are ways we, we, as we're counting along. I can go back now and figure out exactly the number of each one. So there are four people who wanted to play. Sorry, to paint. Two. Sorry, three people chose riding bikes. And then I have a group of five, six, seven children wanted to uh, read books. I have two groups of five, and three kids wanted to, to do the play structure. So remember, when you're doing a tally chart or making tally marks, every number is just a line. But every fifth one, once we get to a group of four, making that fifth line has to go across them. Okay, like the rubber band that keeps it together.